Welcome to this walkthrough video on how to create an NFT collection and put it up for sale. Let's get started. And first thing, let's give it a name and upload a collection image. NFT demo. All right, with that ready to go, let's move on to the next step. Now here we want to select create a new contract. I'm going to select Polygon for this demo. And since we're on staging, this will be going on the Mumbai test network. Also, since we're on staging, I'm going to set the price very low just to preserve our testnet matic. Okay, so pasting in my recipient address. This is a wallet that you need to have control over. This is where the payouts will go to uh, as you sell your NFTs. Next step. And just uh, this give you a quick overview of what everything looks like, the options you've selected, and you can agree to the content policy here and deploy the contract. All right, so with that step done, now we just want to configure some NFTs to actually be minted. So we'll select this manual upload process. And what this means is we can do it right here in the UI. You can also use our REST API to do all of this as well, but we'll go the no code route today. And I'm just going to call this Ninja NFT. I'll give it a supply of 111. All right, let's use that same image that I used before. And we got to give it a quick uh, description. All right, we are set. So I'm going to create this template. And now we can see that we have a supply of 111 available and nothing has been minted yet. Let me show you how you can test this all out. Just click this three dot expander here. For this, I'm going to set an email address. You can also select a wallet and do direct to wallet minting. All right, so now that is actually minting the NFT. While we wait for that process to complete, let's head over to set up the no code storefront. So I'm here on the payments tab. Select the no-code storefront, enable it, and I'll go ahead and keep all of these options live. These first two are cross-chain, and this last one is credit card. All right, so just like that, we already have a page live and ready to uh, purchase NFTs from. Since we are in our staging environment and pointing at test networks, you can purchase with a test credit card. All right, here we go. And you can use any valid data from here on out. All right, so now that process has started. We are actually sending the transaction to the contract that was deployed on your behalf and minting this NFT to the buyer. Go ahead and let this complete really quick. All right, there we go. So from here, I can open it right in my CrossMint wallet, or I could transfer it to MetaMask, for example. I am actually gonna go ahead and jump back to the console so we can take a look. And we'll head back to this NFTs overview. And we can see that now two different NFTs have been minted. We have the first one that I minted right here through the UI by selecting this option. And then this is the one that I just purchased through the no-code storefront. So that's all there is to it. In just under five minutes, you deployed a collection, added the artwork, set up a storefront, and tested it all out end to end. So appreciate you checking out this video. Thank you for watching.